So this is the Black M3 MacBook. The Apple's new high-end MacBook Pro comes in black up to 120GB of RAM. While the M3 Pro and the M3 Max models ditch space for great darker tone including some serious GPU upgrades on the inside. So before talking for full specs, let's talk about the serious upgrades between the previous M2 and the M3 MacBook laptops. The M3 Pro chips now support up to 36GB of RAM, a small increase from the M2 Pro's 32GB maximum. Meanwhile, the M3 Max boosts up to 128GB of RAM, as opposed to the previous 96GB, which is first for an Apple laptop, while the notable change comes to the dark color. So Apple said that the new space black finish will be less of the fingerprint magnet than the black midnight MacBook Air. Uh, speaking of the dark color itself, um, I think uh, the dark color looks like uh, not a bit black, but it looks like a, a dark grayish, but we shall call it the dark color. But for my opinion, I think it's not a very much, well dark, um, let's say like a gray, grayish, dark gray, I think, yeah. So the M2 chips were already speed powerhouses. So this time around, Apple is mostly hyping up graphing enhancement. That were the big repeats for the 3 nanometer M3 chips. They are all capable of hardware accelerated light tracing, which could be a boom for Mac gaming and hardware accelerated mesh shading. The beefed up GPU performance is thanks to the feature that Apple calls dynamic catching, whereby the GPU allocates the use of local memory in hardware in real time so only the exact amount of memory needed is used for each task. Apple say that you can expect up to 20 hours of battery life from the new MacBook Pro. In the 16 M3 Pro model, at least the max in this view is typically slightly. In the 16 inch M3 Pro model, Apple say that you can expect up to 22 hours of battery life from the new MacBook Pro. They will still got the bright construct mini LED display, an extra inch speaker system, three Thunderbolt 4 ports, an HDMI port, an SCD card reader, and the MagSafe connector for charging. The screen can now reach up to 600 nights of brightness for SDR content which is 20% brighter than before. So let's talk for the pricing. Pricing for the 14 MacBook Pro with M3 Pro start for 1,919, with a 16 inch model coming in at the base of price of 2499 Those prices quickly climb if you option for the max chip or start tacking on more storage and memory. A full kit and out 16 inch macro with 8 terabytes of storage and 128 gigabytes of unified memory cost about 7199 If these particular laptops are more than you are looking to spend, there's always a new 14 MacBook Pro with a regular M3 chip that starts for more 1599 if you can live with 8 gigabytes of memory. Yeah, and for my opinion, I think that if you are there on the M3 um, chipset family, I think is not very much necessary to shift from the um, older machine and go to the, and buy the new machine because you are on the same level on the energy. So if you own, a, let's say, um, M2 Pro Max and M1 uh, MacBook, yeah, you can just still uh, just going with them and they just work perfect and the battery will work perfect for editing. Yeah. So thank you for watching this video, until the next time, peace out.